Wilson uh, was walking by the Arrows locker room after the game after they had left and there was stuff written on the whiteboard and one of the interesting stats that Kevin Constantine and crew was pointing out was the even strength goals by lines and it's this Krabs line out there with Stapleton and Anderson and as they score from the line post the C9 shot but that line out there right now leads the team in even strength goals for the Wolves. Well, they certainly have scored a lot of goals. I think probably Postman is going to get the credit for this one. How did this go in, though? Well, there's the chiclet smile. <laughs> Another Canadian. Quite excited to see the big game after this game. Postman shot. Look at that puck drop. drop. It dipped. Oh, all the short. Huh? Wow. So Justin Pogge will drop to his knees, but it has eyes through the blocker underneath the arm. And we talked about the goal we saw earlier from Bickle. Simple wrister through and redirect off a. Renace is still on the ice for the icing. So with all that time that elapsed, whatever it was, first I believe, good enough rest anyway. Yeah, well, well rested. Anthony Stewart behind the net, trying to bump off Ross. He's six saves, now drives to the slot, tip it tight, rebound, they score! Kevin Dahl set up by the A train! Guess what? Kevin Dole was great at what he just did. He had a long conversation with the linesman and Turris, center on center. It was his check. And there he is, number 91. There's 21. Good one in the faceoff. Did get some help. Hunt's going to send it down low. Anthony Stewart very strong with Ross with the puck. He'll move away from Ross, taking it to the net. And the backhander, I think, redirected initially by Dole, but he hung in there, that right-handed shot. Look at him come back with his body and stick, and it elevates it over. The left arm of Pogi. So at one point it was 4-2 in favor of San Antonio. They had a 3-1 lead and a 2-0 lead. And now the Wolves trying to win their eighth game in a row for the first time this season. Have a 5-4 lead. Well, that's going to drive instead. Now Anderson poking it deep. Pogi will try and play away from Sterling who got there to tie him up. Oh. And Anderson's feet had the wrong side of Jason Krog. If he was a left-hander, he would have had a great look. Almost hit Pogi on the way back to the net, too. Now Krog has the look. Tip! Sterling scores! Krog sets it up right in front, and it's 6-4 Chicago. Right place at the right time, and this whole play, Jason, starts off with what you were talking about. Brett Sterling on Heshka. Puck never exited the zone. The pressure, and then the turnover again to Jason Kron, and offensively, they keep everything alive. Post across, Kron, boy, funny Karen. I'm not sure who the forward was that was coming out, but I believe it'll hit his stick and then move to the front of the net. And that's great placement of the body by Sterling in front of the goal. And Jamie Hunt just reaching out, misses it. Pogi lost his stick. Hunt has it. He'll carry it back to the point. Postma with two goals. Wide fight. I just had a feeling when Bogey lost his stick and I saw that play develop in the time. First of all, you know, we, we just missed that. What a play by Stapleton to chip the puck in and get it. Okay, now it's fended off. Here's Hunt. He's going to get another assist, by the way. And this is what I thought. Look at the time he has with a bolt in a stick. And he just threads a needle on the blocker side again. Well, the hats are now cascading onto the ice here at All State Arena. Paul Postma. The rookie is the first Wolf to net a hat trick this season. 20 year old from Red Deer, Alberta. He had 23 goals last year as a defenseman with the Calgary Hitmen. I am sure the Postma clan is all huddled together getting ready for a very big night in Canada, but I'm sure yes. they're watching this too on the old computer. They have to be very excited to see Paul. Lucky it's his, not his sister in net, but he's put three behind. Yes. How about this? The first hat trick of the season from a defenseman. Paul Postma from Jamie Hunt, Noah Welsh at 1453. They're all defensemen figuring into the scoring. We got a final. Grand oh, Rapids good. knocking nice. off Texas. Very nice. Thank you very much. And Milwaukee leading Rockford. That's good right now, I think. Yep. 
Hollig and Simpson were lined up off the faceoff, and Hollig wants no part of Reed Simpson. And these two teams will debate later on, but it's a 7-4 victory for Drew McIntyre, who will pick up the win in goal. That is now his eighth straight. Uh, honestly, I, I'm, I'm almost speechless because I thought this was the game after we saw the start that uh, would turn the negative side after such a great run and you know at some time it would probably come to an end when the team would come out and be a little bit flat after a very emotional night last night and it looked to be that way in this game but never give up this team just relentless the offense is spectacular they seem to click at certain times and just that little kick they need and turn they can turn games around and we saw that in Peoria the other night we see her again and they took over the game and uh, just walked away with it amazing Drew McIntyre, 21 saves for the win. He stopped them all, relieving Peter Manning.